All right, what's going on, you guys? Nick here with Next Time the Power. So I wanted to do a video on an IFBB Pro bodybuilder that many of you have probably already seen photos of, but most of you probably don't know his name or who he is. So this particular bodybuilder's name is Jerry Mentula, but he is more commonly known as the Bull. Now, I'm sure a lot of you guys that have seen photos of Jerry Mentula have seen the photos of him on stage um, with a little bit of Palumboism. He had a pretty distended gut at this particular show. I believe it was the Nordic Pro. And a lot of people seem to include him in the conversation in their videos about Palumboism or posts about Palumboism, but nobody really names him or talks about actually who he is. Now, if you don't know who he is from the Palumboism pictures, you might know who he is from his comparison um, to Marvel's The Thing. There's many photos and videos of him working out where he, get the, he gets like these gnarly forehead veins and forehead wrinkles um, when he works out. His head almost gets a pump, really. Um, and some of those photos have gone viral as well. But again, nobody really talks about who this guy actually is. So Jerry Mentula has actually been an IFBB pro for quite some time now, actually dating back to 2009 where he competed in his first IFBB pro show, which was the 2009 New York Pro, where he did not place. He would follow that up with the 2009 IFBB Tampa Pro, um, where he would also not place. A couple years later in 2011, he would compete in the IFBB Toronto Pro, placing 14th. Then he would compete in the 2013 Nordic Pro, um, where most of the quote-unquote bad photos of him would turn out. And unfortunately, at that 2013 Nordic Pro, he would place dead last or 13th place at that show. So he really hasn't competed that much as a pro and really hasn't competed that much recently. Um, and really, when he does compete, he places dead last or outside of the top 10. So that's probably why a lot of people haven't heard of him or know who he is. And most people have probably just seen photos of the guy. Now, another fascinating thing about Jerry Mentula is the fact he is a Finnish bodybuilder from Finland. Um, and the person that actually trained him for those early shows was Marco Savalainen, um, one of the early uh, Finnish bodybuilders from the 1990s, arguably having the greatest biceps of all time. Um, so Marco, arguably Finland's best bodybuilder ever, um, trained this guy. And you can really see him in the background of some of these photos of him training here. So really the main reason I thought this would be an interesting topic for a video is I see a lot of people, again, as I mentioned before, um, posting photos of this guy, kind of really hating on the guy, making videos about him uh, regarding his Palumboism and not really addressing who he is. Um, but really for a pro bodybuilder, he's a pretty big bodybuilder, um, 300 pounds in the off season or 136 kilograms. His competition weight roughly 275 or 125 kilograms, standing at a height of only five foot 11. So he's not that tall of a bodybuilder. And I think this is a guy that realizes he does not have the greatest genetics in bodybuilding. This is a guy that realizes he has to work hard. Um, every training video that I've seen of this dude, he's killing it in the gym. Um, he knows he doesn't have the best structure. He knows he doesn't have the best genetics. But he does have, you know, really a freaky physique in the gym. He's pretty vascular. He's pretty big. And he has actually become kind of a meme of a bodybuilder, more so due to that extreme vascularity, more so than the whole Palumboism thing. So he's really known for being kind of a freaky bodybuilder. Um, than just being a non-aesthetic bodybuilder. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video, maybe learned a little bit about a bodybuilder that you've seen before but didn't really know who he was. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Nick Strength and Power, signing out.